So <clears throat> there was a question that came up about continuity testing and how do I do it and what do I use? So there's a number of different types of multimeters you can use. There's the high-end one, here's my fluke, which we're not gonna use for this. And then I have this one, which is essentially nothing more than a free Harbor Freight multimeter. It has a setting down here, which allows for continuity testing. And literally this one I got for free with a coupon. And how do I do it? So right here, I've got a couple sets of pigtails. They're all from the same vendor. I have this one here and I have this one here. Identical. All the wire colors are the same on both of them, as you can see here. But how do I actually test it? So essentially here, you can see there's three wires. We've got brown, yellow, and blue. And on the other side, where it's connected, brown, yellow, and blue. The whole purpose is to make sure that blue goes to blue, yellow goes to yellow, brown goes to brown. because internal wiring, however you set it up, it's all that matters. So essentially here, if I take and I connect blue and I connect blue on my multimeter, I should get a reading, which I do. That's the most important thing. You get a reading, you know they're connected. If you don't, they're not connected. What I had happen today, and this particular one, that caused me headaches all day long was I connected blue here and I connected blue here, got nothing. In my setup, brown is V positive. When I connected blue here to brown here, I actually got a reading showing that what I thought was data was actually power. Same setup, same connection, and then obviously they were crossed somewhere within the internal wiring of the actual pigtail itself. So it's important to test them to make sure that blue goes to blue, brown goes to brown, yellow goes to yellow, etc. Whether yours is red and black and yellow or red and black and some other color, it doesn't really matter just ensure that the internal wiring is the internal wiring. Now, if you buy pre-purchased pigtails, you really need to know from the vendor, how do they actually set it up? So from here, this is another example to make sure that you know what's V positive, what's data, and what's ground. In this example, some of this stuff that I purchased from Ray Wu the coloring is different than I actually had it myself, so I needed to understand that to make sure that I actually accounted for that in my setup. But at the end of the day, all that matters is blue goes to blue, brown goes to brown, yellow goes to yellow. Again, Harbor Freight, it's their free cheapo depot multimeter, has one setting for continuity, and that's all you care about.